Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Good morning to the respected judges and all of participants here. As we have gathered here to listen to all of our speeches. And I am Salsa Bila Maulidia Afnita from Muhammadiyah Boarding School Zamzam Chilangok would like to speak of our health is wealth, which is healthy lifestyle. It is most common saying which we generally listen by people around us from our grandparents until the expert. We all do really know and understand about the statement, health is wealth. But do you ever think what is the real meaning of this statement? Nowadays, in the rapid flow of globalization, people's life has been so busy that they have no time for their health maintenance, doing exercise, talk to family, friends, neighbors, and so on because of increasing competition and technology. <coughs> health is the most important asset in our lives. Health is the gift from God which you must never forget to be grateful. Good health is the real wealth that cannot be bought with money. Let's say you have a trillion dollar but you're laying in the bed, sick. Life is not good anymore when you are sick. So health is your greatest treasure. Why? Because when you are unhealthy, you are unable to do the things you would like to do as you pleased. You have a hard time to even get up from your bed. So what is the point of having a lot of money when you lost the health? For inside, you can eat sweet things anymore when you have got a serious diabetes mellitus. You can't go travel as much as you like anymore. As a mere human, you need to remember that health don't always stay with you as we grow older time by time. In fact, during this century, chronic diseases have increased rapidly. I believe this is mainly because of our unhealthy lifestyle. From now on, we have to start practicing a healthy lifestyle for a better life. No more excuses. But the question is, how do we start? My loving audiences, we can deny that the food is very important for us in order to live, but without we even realizing it that the type of food that we are eating, healthy diet, either healthy diet or unhealthy diet, can, can, can give a huge impact to our life. I am totally agree that healthy lifestyle is important for us to live our life to the fullest. Furthermore, eating healthy diet can contribute to good feelings and thinking capability. Healthy lifestyle can be defined as maintaining a balanced and nutritious diet as well as engaging in sport or other fitness-related activities. Even though healthy diet may sound like heavy burden to some, but eating healthy diet is not the most strict limitation of food, staying unrealistically thin or depriving yourself and from the food that you love or whatsoever. Actually, eating healthy diet is the opposite than all of us thought. It's about making your body feel great, having more energy, improving your health and mood as well. Eat more veggies and fruits, consume less sugar and salt, reduce intake of harmful fat, be active and consume vitamins can sustain a healthy body, rather than eliminating any food categories from our diet. Here are some tips on how to set yourself up for success in dieting purposes. The first step is to make the right changes. A fresh healthy diet itself can be reflected as a clean of all unhealthy food, but keep in mind that all those unhealthy food that we, that we already cut need to be replaced, but with a healthy substitute. For example, replacing a fried chicken to grill salmon for your fat meat. This can ensure that our body doesn't lose any nutrition yet, st still, eating, still eat clean and healthy. For the next step, exercise regularly is the key to maintain a healthy life. People should at least exercise 30 minutes a day for 5 days a week. In this scenario, people can do various of physical activities such as jogging, hiking, and probably swimming. One of the most benefits of exercise is to improve your muscles and bone strength. As you're getting older, your bone density tends to lose rapidly, but physical activities can slow the loss of bone density. Ladies and gentlemen, the last but not least, you need to do regular checkup at the hospital and clinic. Have you ever heard prevention is better than cure? Honestly speaking, it is way better if we avoid the risk of getting diseases instead of treating the diseases that we afflicted with. Bear in mind that early diagnosis is important to determine the diseases and the best treatment for it. Early diagnosis also can cure the diseases at the early, at the early stage and at the early stage before it becomes life-threatening. 
However, many of the citizens take for granted. In a nutshell, healthy lifestyle can include a balanced diet, doing physical activities, and regular checkup. You yourself decide how you would live your life. The choice is in your hands. Health is wealth. Hence, you should be aware with your body. All the healthy lifestyle can be achieved with hard work and dedication. Other people can do it, so why don't you? It is not difficult to keep yourself healthy. A slogan body fit, brain smart indicates the importance of practicing a healthy lifestyle in order to ensure your, your good health in a longer lifespan. Robert Urich once said, Healthy outside start in the inside. So you should take care of your meal, your organs, and your body system. Don't rush it, just start slowly. For example, exercising 10 minutes a day and increase the number as time flies. Slowly, we make a difference. Thank you. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.